Yo, what's going on, guys? And we are here today. So, we're going to run through this. The Cavaliers and Colin Sexton are allegedly still far apart. I want to hear your thoughts down below. If you guys are a Cleveland Cavaliers fan, what do you guys think of this Colin Sexton news? We've gone through a bunch of it this year, but let's talk about it. So, as you guys have heard, we know there's a few teams supposedly interested in him as the Wizards, Miami Heat, and Jazz were reportedly interested in Colin Sexton. But we knew that Colin Sexton was looking for, you know, Bogdan Bogdanovich money and close to $20 million a year. But he was being offered a three-year, $39 million deal, I believe, somewhere around $13 million. And now it's being reported by Chris Fedor of Cleveland's Plain Dealer. That sources told Cleveland.com that the talks between the Cavaliers and Colin Sexton camp, led by ruthless player-friendly negotiator Rich Paul, the CEO of Clutch Sports, have not been great. They're at a standstill. And the two sides are very far apart on valuation. Cleveland.com has been reporting for weeks that the Cavaliers are offering a three-year contract worth around $40 million, with an annual salary of $13 million per year, like I previously mentioned, three-year $39 million deal. But... Supposedly, Rich Paul, the agent of Colin Sexton, doesn't share the same view, near does Sexton. And this is ca contrary of the report that a lot of Cavaliers fans have said that Colin Sexton's fine with the money and Rich Paul isn't, but A. To them, Sexton is a starting caliber two guard who should be paid as such. And they're trying to argue that they're justifying that Colin Sexton should get Jalen Brunson and Anthony Simons money, but the Cavs are looking at this and they're kind of like, hey, you're more of a... You're not even up in the Lonzo Ball, Malcolm Brogdon, Terry Rozier deals, okay? So right now, Sexton Camp is open to just taking the qualifying offer, which the deadline for that is October 1st, and the two sides can mutually agree to extend said deadline. Now, we've talked about this for a while now that we think the best thing for Colin Sexton to do at this point, unless a team can come in and sign and trade for him, which I would not be opposed for a team to come in and sign and trade for him, I think a team like the Dallas Mavericks could very much benefit from bringing in Colin Sexton. But I think at this point, a lot of Cavaliers fans would agree that it's in his best interest to go out there and get himself, you know, to take that qualifying offer and enter free agency next year unrestricted. Okay. They'll have his bird right so they can match. It can pay him more than anybody else, but with that being said, he can go out there and somebody can pay him and he won't be restricted. So I think that right there would be the best for him in this current situation. It's just, look, I like Colin Sexton. I think he's a great player. Yes, he is an undersized two guard. And there have been plenty of undersized two guards as of late to have success in the NBA. But I agree that, Colin, you're coming off a meniscus injury and that's there are questions there and also you're i also want to know if rich paul is gonna like rich paul's hated by <laughs> nba executives for his the way he gets his players paid okay and sometimes i feel like rich paul doesn't care about the team he just cares about his players getting paid which is fine but look the Cavs are thinking like hey we got people to pay in the future we can't pay Colin Sexton long term. And I know there's that Karis LeVert argument. And they also drafted Ochai Abaji. So I think they kind of, like, they want to bring him back. But they also brought in Ronald Neto to back up Ricky Rubio. So they're they're fine without him. I want to hear your guys' thoughts down below if you guys agree with me on this or is this just me. But that's basically it for me, guys. I hope you guys do have a great day. Like and subscribe. Go check out my NBA show. Link in the description. NFL channel as well.